वेलकम टू हेराल टीवी न्यूज एट थ्री विथ मी शालेन It's been more than 11 months that the Anganwadi workers were fighting to get absorbed back into service. Earlier Chief Minister Pramod Sawant assured to revoke their termination orders, but this was not fulfilled. Tuesday was the 6th day that the Anganwadi workers have launched their chain hunger strike. Anganwadi workers are back on strike at Azad Maidan Panjim. Anganwadi workers resort to chain hunger strike. They are fighting to get absorbed back into service. आज हा स वर्कर स दीस जाए धरण आंदोलन बसला आ स दिशान सरकार दखल घेना न डिपार्टमेंटान दखल घेना हिस्ट्री सक खबर आसा कि कशा प्रकार हंका हेरसमेंट जो कशा प्रकार आंदोलन स्टार्ट जाए आतंत क्या तीन डिमांड्स पास जाए पे सगे जर सरकार एक एश्योरस दिल्ले मुख्यमंत्री कि हेर एक्शन जाऊचे ना मुझे बट नवीन कैबिनेट आये तो बरबर हा वर्कर एक्शन जाने मैं टर्मिनेशन ऑफ सर्विस आता सतुए हमें ऑफिस बेरर्स प्रोटेक्टेड वर्कमेन आसा एक्चुअली पैं वर्कमेन तं टर्मिनेशन अभी मोटी ऑर्डर मेजर डिशीजन घजुन पर रिवोक जाएना कारण मुख्यमंत्री संगे कि एक महीन भर अपन रिवोक करते विश्वजीत राणे खी ती फाइल हड़ता अब मुख्यमंत्री संगता आपको भरले खरे खोटे कहीं खबर ना पा सगे हतुत त्रास जो को राजण वर्कर जता मु काल रि लेट नाइट वो डिशीजन घ आईज चेन हंगर स्ट्राइक ये वर्कर्स बसतली आज देवयानी तामसे जे हा यूनियन के प्रेसिडेंट आसा तंे स्टार्ट के शी इज ऑल्सो टर्मिनेटेड वर्कर सो आज चेन हंगर स्ट्राइक हम स्टार्ट जला आता सरकार विचार कर चेन हंगर स्ट्राइक आमरण उपोषण करप कई ना ये सरकार आसा कारण आता खुद एक्सटेंडर वो तैयारी दौर कारण आता तंक सोचना कारण एक इलिगल टर्मिनेशन तो इलिगल टर्मिनेशन एक अभी बैल का जी बीजेपी स्पोन्सर्ड तैयार खुर्चेर बसला कारण ती मटा कि कांग्रेस के काम के सगैंक काम वाले का सो एक डायरेक्टर गवर्नमेंट ऑफिसर जर पार्टी लेवल एलिगेशन घून जर को काटा आसा जैसे फर्स्ट हम डिमांड जो आता तो तिका सैक कर बिकॉज शी इज अ बीजेपी स्पोन्सर्ड पर्सन हम पैशन थे पगार खाता दुसरो डिमांड आसा तो मैं हा स वर्कर टर्मिनेशन जे आसा रिवोक कर जो पर हिं दोन गोषी जाएना तो पर्यटन वर्कर संगजन उठपा ना Chief Minister Pramod Sawant said that within a year necessary laws will be amended in the Goa Legislative Assembly so that farmers get the agricultural land which belongs to the Batkas or the landlords. Chief Minister was speaking on the sidelines of the Prime Minister's Garib Kalyan Yojana meeting with farmers of the entire country on Tuesday. Farmers who faced issues under any of the beneficiary schemes raised issues before the Prime Minister via video conferencing from four centers from Goa. Despite land to tiller and munka laws, farmers still do not own their lands. Chief Minister Dr. Pramod Sawant said that within a year, necessary laws would be amended in Goa Legislative Assembly. He assured that the farmers would get the agricultural land which belongs to the Batkars, that's the landlords. आई प्रधानमंत्री गरीब कल्याण महोत्सव वो कार्यक्रम पूरा देश भर माननीय प्रधानमंत्री आठ वर्ष सरकार पूरा जता हजे निमित्ता आयोजन के लिए गोय सरकार हजे चार कड़े आयोजन आशि मिनेजीस ब्रगांजा हॉल पणजे तेजा उपरान मड़गव रविन्द्र भवन केवीके साउथ केवीके नॉर्थ हम राज्य सगले मंत्री आमदार हा कार्यक्रम नॉर्थ साउथ वेगवे जागे आशि हंगसर हाँ हम केन्द्रीय मंत्री श्रीपाद नाईक मंत्री रोहन कवटे पार्टी के अध्यक्ष आनवड़े मंत्री बमनीकर हणकर आमदार शेट प्रेमीन शेट ये हंगसर तेजा बरबर गोये वेग वेग बेनिफिशरीज वेगवेग स्कीमी हंगसर माननीय प्रधानमंत्री नरेन्द्र मोदी जी हंका आयक आशि ताजा पैली हमें तं बरबर इंटरेक्शन के प्रधानमंत्री आवास योजना आसते उज्ज्वला योजना आसते विमा योजना आसते हा सग बरबर इंटरेक्शन करूँ तंका कसो फायदो जो कि प्रॉब्लम्स आशि क्या हजे इंटरेक्शन ही के लोकानों खूब बोलो रिस्पॉन्स आशि प्रधानमंत्री कल्याण योजने अंतर्गत वेगवेगे स्कीमी योजना ते हंगसर बेनिफिट्स घता मैक्जिमम प्रधानमंत्री अन्न महोत्सव हे स लखा वर बेनिफिशरीज गोय आसा शगुन गावडे फॉर हेराल्ड टीव्ही St. Joseph Vass College students in association with Nisarga Goenso Ekwot Chikali youth farmers and other planted mangroves near Pornebat Zorint at Sankwal Bay 
This is an attempt to restore nature for future generations. Goenza Equot stated that this human initiative will be taken across Goa to protect the environment. St. Joseph was college students and others planted mangroves near Pornebad Zorind at Sankhwal Bay. This is an attempt to restore nature for future generations, they said. Goenso Airport stated that this human initiative will be taken across Goa to protect the environment. It's like a Lansa attempt when uh, mangroves, these are mangroves, they germinate when they are still attached to the mother plant. So that is called as viviparity. They think a germinate zala upran, then it will fall down. So naturally it is supposed to take root where it falls down. Yeah. Part of the environment, thanks to the initiative of uh, Father Bolmax, who has been an inspirational uh, force in the green revolution that is taking place across Goa. And uh, going to Court uh, has been there since the inception of CYFC, which is also part of uh, one of the organizations in our village. And uh, we appreciate that uh, uh, the local community across Sankwal, in Gortali, Belsang, Kansalim, and as far as, as from the north of Goa have come together to, you know, to, to uh, give back to the environment, you know. And uh, this is just a start. Today is just a start of this mango production. We are as going to so work along with uh, Father Polmex, CYFC and uh, Nisagara uh, Nature Group. We are going to take it across Goa. Kiran Borger for Herald TV. Making a reference to constitutional provision for a uniform civil code, Goa Governor P. S. Sridharan Pillai praised its implementation in Goa. He also lauded Goa's communal harmony and suggested an in-depth study of the same, since communities live in harmony and communal riots are non-existent. He also called for study of, for the continental system for jurisprudence which was followed in Goa till 1961. One needs to come to Goa and study it, Governor said. He was speaking at the 35th Statehood Day celebrations on Monday. Goa Governor P. S. Sridharan Pillai praised Goa's communal harmony and suggested an in-depth study of the same. Governor also called for the study of the continental system of jurisprudence which was followed in Goa till 1961. The raw material and practical approach for this is available in Goa, he said. But as far as this state is concerned, here, people from various religions, Hindu, Muslim, Christian, everybody peacefully, I am underlining peacefully, living in this state. And during the last 35 years, the mandate of, mandate of the constitution under 44 is successfully following this state. I don't understand why in our country, a successful attempt, that too positive, without any objection from anybody. Cordially, people are, in India, communal rights are very, very less in Goa. No such incident at all, according to me. In such a situation, I think as a student of law, or a student of constitution, or as an ordinary citizen, I would like to say this is high time for us to look into Goa in that direction. What are the positives? What are the negatives? And how to solve the problem? An in-depth study basing on Goa is the need of the hour according to me. You can come and but here, continental system was followed through the Portuguese time and the spirit is there till 1961. And for a comparison, our law commissions and the system was searching for that, spending money for that. I think our state is the best place for the search, research and other works. The annual ban on fishing by trawlers will commence from June 1st and last till July 31st. Fishing by trawlers is banned during the monsoon sit since it is the spawning period when fish lay eggs. The ban is enforced to allow the fish to breed and multiply. 
Fisheries Minister Nilkant Halankar said strict patrolling will be carried out during the ban. Trawlers will be allowed to venture into the sea only from August 1st. Fishing ban comes into force in Goa from 1st June 2022. Fisheries Minister said strict patrolling will be carried out. Trawlers will be allowed to venture into the sea only from August 1st, 2022. First July, uh, uh, June, then July 31st person ban us. Uh, and in total control group, uh, government machinery use control. So, control the control the So, in the, in the, in the, in the, so, in the, in the, 61 days are banned or fishing ban? 61 days as per yearly routine work. Yeah. For the breeding of fish, this yeah. will be banned and it will be total controlled yeah. by the government. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. is ready to control fish. Since the fishing ban is due to be implemented from June 1st, most of the trawlers were hauled up on land. On Monday, some unknown person lit fire at an open space in the fishing village of Shapora. The fire was lit just 5 meters away from nearly 40 trawlers which were kept on land. Yes, 40 trawlers were saved by fire service at Shapora, a locals called the Fire Brigade. Locals have demanded an inquiry and action against the person involved in this mischief. Unknown person lit fire at an open space in Shapora on Monday. Some 5 meters away, nearly 40 trawlers were parked on land due to the oncoming monsoons. Fire services saved the 40 fishing trawlers at Shapora from being burnt. I don't know I'm saying, I'm saying. Issues alo. As commentary, anger we use a lot of rati ki ne koron. To rat bar ki ne jhoro ani varyan suddenly rati ki ek sun gatana gadli na. Jao jao sudayman anger koon vaise pahunta le. Kya lokani thakur use a petta moon pole lo ani sada anger inform kya le. Inform koron ham apsa star apsa chaniyon anger don fire wicket diye le. Don double tenchani anger yon tatiri. Tenchani ek amplo time waste na karta. Tenchani ek amtir orlo bala waga jo orlo ghatta ra halwa jai kaiswan. Kya no kaushi history? Koi chay kine daatale? Kamit kamit panna saath boti ulpa tole ashleyo. Ane dis taibe. Adun don te ban fire wicket dio na to tenchani upale lo. Tari uzo adun ulpa hunga yen daang na kamit daang na. O uzo ata tari astana vara to yekira fiber te chemical ag lagon o uzo palao na. Kya kya boating sagla fiber ke le ha. Aaj dis taal thunga. ताकत now the Dargal and Korgam Panchayats had passed unanimous resolutions to stop abusive practices against widows during their husband's funeral and later isolating widows from social and religious functions. The villagers resolved to put an end to the social isolation of widows after passing away of their husband. Speaking to media, Panchayat officials said that government and Chief Minister Savant should enact some legislation on this issue as there are remote areas where still the women's kumkum is wiped off from their forehead and her bangles are broken on the death of her husband. Dhargar and Korgaon Panchayats have passed unanimous resolution to stop abusive practices against widows. The abusive practices are there during husband's funeral and later isolating widows from social and religious functions. Panchayat officials said that government and CM Savan should annex some legislation on this issue. <laughs> तब तेंचानी आंगसर हम चाह गोयन जाओ तो हम गोयन जाता ना तो पेंडन हम चाह पहली जाओ तो अनि पेंडन पहली जाओ बाप ते का मज़ा सपोर्ट आस्था लो इधर वोट थराव हम चाह परगाव पंचायती तसा दारगई पंचायती ते दोनी थराव हम चाह ताल ग्राम सभी एक मार्ग लला हाँ अनि तो थराव पास करूँ गेट लला तसा मज़ा 
विधवा जाली जेना तेजी ते बायले वाइट नदरेन पता जेना ती बायल भाई वेता दुसरे दुसरे पता वाइट नदरेन पता तेका खर आता समाज चतुर्थी आ चतुर्थी आता टाइम ते बैले आरती घूम जाएना आरती क्या ये खेच मुखार बरयले ना क्या जेना बैल विधवा जाली ये दिवचे ना खेच मुखार बरयले ना अका दिता वो तंका मेला जाए राइट मेला जाए क्या विधवा बैल आ पी आप मंगलसूत्र घोन अपने भूगेक अपने फेमिली जगोक जाए आज ग्राम सभा पूरी जो मांडत है आमगा पंचायत क्षेत्र पति या निधना नर पति विधवा मन न हिंडवता समाज जुनिया प्रथा है बाबत कर एक स्त्री मन इतर स्त्री सारखे तिना जगने का अधिकार दया तसे पति या निधना नर समाज सर्व कार्यक्रम तिना मान सन्म्मा प्राप्त करूँ दे मानुसकी दर्शन घड़न आयानी आम् गावत विधवा रूढ़ी बाबत पुढ़ाकार दयावा ठराव ग्राम सभी मांडत आम घरकार जहाँ भाव आसते देर आसते आनी को जर सपोर्ट के जर स अपने फेमिली बाबा जा जाओ जर तेज घो पिंडा जो चल आज ये कि करता पे आदले तो करूं ना अभी संगे दादी संगे बैला दुखी आसता जर दादी सपोर्ट के दादी जर सक फुड़ाकार काम जाऊ शकता हमें सग परगवचा मनशा गोयकारको संगूं सकता कि जो हमें निर्णय बैलान घेला तो सगैं सपोर्ट बैलानी करो आदार हाँ रिक्वेस्ट करता कि जे निर्णय घता बैलान जो आंखें फुड़ाकार कर सपोर्ट कर An obscene video, which was shot at the government dam site in 2020, has come to haunt actress Poonam Pandey. Goa police have filed a charge sheet against her and husband Sam Bombay in this connection. Kanakorna Police Inspector Pravin Gavas said the charge sheet is filed under various sections dealing with obscenity, trespassing, and circulating the obscene video. The charge sheet against actress Poonam Pandey and her husband Sam Bombay was filed last week before JMFC Kanakorn. Pandey and Bombay were in Goa in November 2020 when they were booked for shooting an obscene video. The video was shot at Government Chapodi Dam in Kankon. Both were arrested for the offence and were later released on bail. Gavas said that police have recorded statements of 39 witnesses in the case who would be examined by the court during the trial. Pandey and Bombay are charged under section 477 trespassing. 292 293 obscenity 294 reciting or uttering an obscene song or words in public place section 4 and 6 of indecent representation of women prohibition act 1986 and section 67a of information technology act have been used That's all we have in today's news bulletin. Thanks for watching Herald TV News. For more news alerts, please follow us on O Heraldo on Facebook and Twitter. Take care and goodbye.